The election office in Johnson County, they have been working all night to get those results. But we're told it could be at least a couple more hours before they're all in. Probably around 8 o'clock is what they're expecting now. 41 Action News reporter Charlie Keegan live inside the Johnson County Election Office with Election Commissioner Ronnie Metzger. Charlie, is 8 o'clock still a good target this morning? That is what we're hearing. Yes, Taylor, eight o'clock seems to be the time that they hope to have all the results, um, you know, re revealed at this point, the unofficial but final results. We are here with Ronnie Metzger, the Johnson County Elections Commissioner. Tell me, I guess, uh, why are we shooting for that eight o'clock, uh, you know, uh, deadline? Uh, how do you think that we'll get to that point? Well, our, our significant focus, of course, is to get these tallies and the report of the tallies out and in a timely fashion. But it's been very difficult to slow as the processors have been working. And uh, so we, we do the, re the report I get from our technicians is that they expect to have it the unofficial total by 8 a.m. So as soon as we get it, we'll bring it out. Fantastic. Yeah, the technicians are just in another room right kind of behind us here in the building working on this. Now tell us why has it been kind of a slow process this go around compared to years past? Well, actually, we don't know, but we will get to the bottom of that as we as we dig into it. The manufacturers reps are here, the technicians that actually built this software. Uh, and the hardware, they're all here and they're working their way through this, helping us uh, get this done so that we can get this election finished and then they'll be digging into it and help us find out what the, what the cause was and what we do to fix it. Gotcha, so a couple of steps here that we're all kind of going on throughout the, the day here. Now lastly, a lot of people watching today are might think, hey, my vote probably won't even get counted in this. How can you reassure that everyone who voted in Johnson County is gonna be part of this election? Absolutely, uh, the voting machines that were used in this election have the tabulators built right in. The data that came in from the polling locations is here. It's safe, secure, and accurate. We have no reason to question that whatsoever. Uh, the integrity of this election is intact. And so the voters should rest assured of that. And now, of course, our, our key is to get the reports out so that we can all learn what the final tally is. Fantastic, exactly. Ronnie, I know a lot of people are keeping their close eye on the results from Johnson County and how that'll impact races like the one for the Republican nominee for governor. Ronnie's been up all night. Hopefully he can get some sleep here shortly. Reporting live in Johnson County, I'm Charlie Keegan, 41 Action News Today.